and welcome everybody to another Tier Total War Let's Play as the Visigoths. Now, last time we moved further into the, uh, no, we besieged this place here. And you guys were building that, okay. We were hoping the Visigoths, the Ostrogoths were going to join us. But, apparently not. It looks like they're going north, I think. <coughs> we'll see, whatever. Um, but yes, we left uh, the Eastern Roman Empire behind. And... We were moving further towards our goal, which was the Roman capital, and we made a little bonus mission for ourselves to sack the city of Rome. So, as far as I can tell, our route now is going to be something like this, swing around like that. And I've been thinking, whilst off camera, <coughs> where would be the best spot to uh, settle? And we had said, to settle in Liguria, because that's where the Western Roman capital is, and we thought, hey, let's just take the Western Roman capital. Thinking back on it now, perhaps not the best thing to do, because it's right in the middle of uh, the Western Roman Empire, as the capital might be. So, rethinking that, we have a few choices ahead of us. We can keep on just migrating around, sacking and pillaging as we go. We can settle, and this one is not, uh, this is one, I'm mentioning it just because, because it's, it's an option, but it's not my favorite. We can settle here, but that would put us in between the two empires. We can go all the way through to Iberia, settle here, or we can go up north and try and take Britain from there, from the uh, Romans or Saxons or Geats or whoever has got it now. Uh, the other two options, which I'm just mentioning because of there, are we can cross the sea and settle in Africa, or, and this here would be the ballsiest decision to go with, we can turn our attention back to the Eastern Roman Empire, and take the city of Constantinople as our capital and make a little empire around here. So those are, those are our options. Um, I think until we decide on a uh, final course of action we're just gonna go with the, all, the our own little mini quest to uh, sack the capital there and then we'll sack their capital there but when we get to uh, sacking the actual capital and not the former capital of Rome, we're going to uh, have to decide on which course of action we would like to take. Um, yeah, no, it's. Uh, I mean, if we go this way, we've got two allies here anyway. So that's something to consider. And actually, having said that, this will be in between the two empires. We do have those two allies there. So we could, if we took Italy, that's Nina. If we took Italy, then we'd be in between the two empires, but one of the sides would have our allies on, and the other one would have a fully fledged Western Roman Empire on it. So, but I do like the idea of uh, Iberia better, actually. I'm thinking we're probably going to end up here, but anyway, that's not till a little bit later. So we're what we're what in spring? Yes, yeah, spring. Okay, uh, you sir, did we complete all these little little things? Be at war, yeah, and yeah, we got all the little bonuses. So now we just got to uh, survive until spring of. We got to survive one year to complete that first part. We should also probably look towards what we're going to gain, what, how we're going to win this as well. Okay. Maintain control of following provinces. Okay, done that. That'll be easy. That'll come with time, and that'll come with time. Okay. Uh, okay, we got that. 
So, we're just going to have to look at whether we want cultural or military victory. Cultural is... So it's wanting to, us to go this way anyway. Dominance, have these ones, Mead Hall. Research 16 civil, okay. And what's this? Control 60 sevenths. Okay. Defeat 20 factions by capturing, raising their last. Okay. Uh, maintain. Uh huh. Okay. And what's this one? Okay, so basically have a Western Roman Empire. For the most part, anyway. These ones are 20 pounds sure. Okay. <clears throat> yes, okay. So at the moment, it's too early to say which one we'll be going for, but I'm leaning towards a cultural one there. But uh, anyway. Without further ado, let's end this turn here, and we'll assault that place of Aquilia next turn, now that the children of the forest have uh, finished their building, whichever one that is, I can't remember what the building was myself at the moment. Now I'm going to actually start looking at getting some priests trained as well some priests and some other agents because once we do decide to settle down and I've seen I, mean, I, have, I have had a look on the forums and some people have suggested keep on moving for uh, Visigoths, just keep on all hordes, just keep on moving but um, I've decided that we are going to settle we are going to stop travelling eventually it's just a question of where are we going to stop travelling to you know, where are we going? Where, when we reach a point, where are we going to stop? Uh, the arguments for Britain were that it's isolated, so it'd be better, to the, easier to defend. Um, my argument for the Iberia one was that we won't be in the middle of a Western Roman Empire, which is always a nice thing. Uh, so yeah, there's always little different things. No warrior likes standing alone in battle. Should we not watch for each other? Uh, for now, I suppose yes I will. Because we want to isolate the Western Roman Empire. We want to be at war with like pretty much just the West, the Roman Empires. And what's this? Critical success. Oh, that's not good. So, you finished your hunter's camp, yes? So, yeah, you can get nice new troops now. Mm, you should have been able to. What was it? That you can give me... Unlocks me of Germanic Horsemen. Monty Warband. Noble Germanic Horsemen. Band, Gothic Band, Warband. Am I just not... Seeing it, oh well, whatever. Um, yeah, no, we'll go and we'll turn. What's the what, which one do we want to go with you? I think for your one, you're gonna be the uh, one that goes to the cavalry. No, you'll go, go with archers, but for now, we'll move you. And your next command. We'll attack this place. Settlement. And I think we'll actually attack it because when we've been letting the AI do it, the losses have been higher than I would have liked. Silly AI. So we'll just use our own troops and control them ourselves. They don't have a wall, do they? No. This is just a minor settlement.
Another thing I'm thinking is uh, when we actually do finally settle, wherever that may be, we are going to uh, lose our um, horde mechanics, you know, the uh, whole encampment thing. So, we're going to have to make sure that we are, first of all, in a well-defined spot. Second of all, have uh, a uh, have dominance in that area. And clear dominance, not like, oh, I think we'll be okay. No, we need to know we'll be okay for a few turns there. And, uh, yeah, uh, we'll have to get a few promises quickly and get them converted quickly because I believe that uh, the the income will just get shot. Our economy will get completely destroyed when we settle. So we'll just have to do it in a reasonably uh, stable way there. And you can have archers in front there. Start battle. Destroy that tower. <coughs> oh, cool, a forge. Reinforcing troops, and not a moment too soon. Oh, cool, on the other side as well. <laughs> Where's your catapults, or did you lose them? Or am I just not seeing them? Am yeah, I gonna have to check that? Oh, there they are. There they are, I'm just not seeing it. Silly me. Oh, hang on. We have destroyed the enemy tower! Enemy has been spotted. Yeah, we're gonna have to. We will crush the enemy with our greater numbers. Hmm. You guys need to stay the hell away. Are you guys in infantry? Hmm. You guys will draw. You guys can come over here. And you guys form up like this. <laughs> what we really need is to find a safe spot to uh, sit down for a while to replenish our units because they are getting just worn down. I do not like that. Definitely be happy about that situation. Come on there, bud, you can break any time now. You guys. Just do this. Scrimmage mode enable, please enable. Turn that off though. Okay, charge into them. You guys are not even moving because I didn't tell you to do anything yet. It's okay. Fair enough. You guys just form up like this for now. Around like that. And spears like this. Ch 
charger. Okay, perhaps didn't have to send you that far back, but wanted to make sure you're out of the way. Skirmish mode enabled, and please just run here. Get them all in position. Do that. And you've got ammo as well, and you're probably going to have to throw back at me. But, but doesn't really matter. They're only breaking so. You're shattered already. Holy crap. <laughs> okay. And battle. Decisive. Cool. Good to hear. Good to hear. We lost how many? One, 113 against 521. <clears throat> okay. Yeah, we know we really need to just hide somewhere and let the uh, the troops re uh, replenish. If I can liberate this zone here, if there's something to liberate in this zone here, um, I think I will liberate it and we'll just chill here for a few turns to work back up to full strength. I mean, I would love to have sacked it, but, you know, whatever. Sack? Okay, Sack is the only one that's available. For the tribe! Warriors all! On the move, lads! And you guys can go here. And do you have enough for movement? Damn, you don't. Oh well. So we'll just move you a little bit more further. Then. Do we want to raise it as well? Have that little barrier there for them. We'll leave it for now. So yeah, we'll end the turn. So we're gonna go down towards Verona, next place is, is on our list, yep, Verona, and we're going to want to replenish our troops in between then, we'll have one city, def uh, one horde assault and one horde replenish, and whichever horde uh, was replenishing can attack Ravenna after Verona has fallen, uh, and so forth, so forth, it's like a leapfrog thing, we'll work it like that. Hopefully at this point the uh, Western Roman Empire is just way distracted on uh, the northern frontier there. At least too distracted to uh, send like lots of armies down to us. I mean that might change the closer we get to the capital. I mean I would definitely be different than that. Maybe we'll do a Western Roman Empire campaign after uh, the Visigoths. That'll be interesting to see. Hey. Fight off all those little barbarian invasions. I think if uh, we did, I think we'd have to just cut some provinces off for first part and then, like. Uh, you are worthy and strong, and only fools sure, not yeah. wish to be friends. Uh, what was I saying? Oh, yes, I think we'd probably be um, we cutting some provinces off no and then. Alone in battle. Uh, Should we not watch for each other? 
you want to give me money? <laughs> there you go. Give me money. The spirits have guided us to agreement. Coolio. Strength ranking. Just, uh, what's, oh, okay, let's try and save this again. So yeah, if I was playing as the Western Roman Empire, I think I'd probably cut some of the provinces off that were on the uh, edge there. Um, probably Britannia, Adebanya and that, I think. Uh, probably the provinces here. Northern. If he has any in Africa, I'd abandon those as well. Cool. Sounds good. Defensive Alliance. Defensive Alliance. Rank gain. Cool. Ready for battle. Uh, we want you to go here. And here. There we go. Now then. We Ugh. Can't because it's in his own control. Auto resolve it. Aggressive. Yeah, no, we're just gonna have to do the whole like sack and then raise it because I don't want to get stuck in the zone of control. It's just annoying. And raise. You have further orders. Bye bye. <laughs> Can you not move? I guess not. Okay, might as well encamp here. Ready for battle. And you can't even. Yeah, you can't even do that. Oh, you're some besieging here as well, hey. So is this their capital? I think this is their capital. Enemy. Yeah, I think this might be it. So the. Who are you? You're the Roxolianes. Roxolanians. Yeah, Roxolanians. You guys are going to take the Roman capital. Cool. Well, have fun with that. Good luck and all that. But, anyway, so, sir, you are encamped. We have money. Recruit agent, please. We cannot recruit agent. Requires trading ground. Able spies. Okay. What would... In, what would... Okay, the lawmaster's quarters. Ha. Huh. Okay. And you, sir. What, what, what do you need? No one. You need a royal pavilion. What? Which one do we have now? Lavish tents. Is that it? Yeah. So you're gonna have to go. Okay. One of you is gonna have to go for the uh, nobleman. Uh, does actually, don't you want? Don't one of you guys already have the nobleman? Huh. I thought. I thought I already got nobleman for one of you. Ready for I guess battle. not. All right, that's all right because it's so damn expensive. That's why we didn't have it. Okay, so Warriors you, sir, need a turn because you're stuck in the zone of control. Or were anyway. Um, you can Ready upgrade the orders. army. Oh, cool. We're gonna get this for even more morale. And against nomadics, we don't really want that. Eastern Empires, don't really care. Uh, that was, I mean, this was the really one that we only cared about in this area here. Mm. I like that. I like the minus uh, four and the plus one. Okay, I'm going to put a point into this and it's gonna be this one here is the useless one for now um, this is just a means to an end to get this here um, yeah cool we should rename these uh, armies as well we'll do that later on <coughs> so brings a victory you guys are good for Children battle. of the forest, you guys aren't. You still need. Uh, yeah, you, still, you guys still need to replenish. Okay, and that's the income. Okay, we'll just end the turn. 
And it'll be two more turns, I believe, until we get to the the uh, checkpoint there. Which will be a nice little increase in our money. Because we got all of the little bonuses done. Go on, on, cons. You can do it. Roman Empire East. Roman Empire West. Oh, East. What are you doing? Who is that? Is that Ostrogoths? Are we allied? No, that's not Ostrogoths, is it? I'm curious now. We'll just have to go see who that is. Western Roman Empire's armies. Oh, no. Agent. My bad. And the Western Roman Empire is not looking good. Illegitimate birth. Oh, that's unfortunate. Destroyer. <laughs> uh, How oh, we have a guy. Uh, religious change in Dacia. Latin Christian. Former was Greco Roman. Paganism. Uh huh. Okay. For the tribe. Well, you guys are what replenishing at that rate? Uh, rivalry. Yeah, no, we really don't. Hmm. Okay, see, so that's the Ostrogoths. So who are you, sir? Why can I? You know, you disappeared. Oh, there you are. Is cause that one? It's the is Izzy's. I'm gonna call him Iaz. I the Iaz. <laughs> the ears. Uh huh. Okay. So you guys, you guys aren't doing anything. You're just replenishing. I think we'll. Cause you can, you can both move now. You can't move. Have your encampment. Now you can move. Okay, we'll move Get you. Is that all? And we'll besiege you. Uh, we'll maintain siege for a second there. Uh, how would I go about coming this way? Uh, do I need to go th through Verona? Oh, I need to go all the way around. Huh. Well, we'll go here for now. We'll put you in that. And we'll just assault this boat. That'll be in the next episode. Hope you enjoyed this episode, guys. If you did, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And uh, on the next episode, we'll sack and possibly raise the city of Verona. Uh, hope to see you again next time. Until then, bye. And have a good day.